What's going on, guys? Well, me and Shelly are at the community action, uh, getting some food. And uh, what we're going to do with all the meats is we're going to give the meat to her grandmother. And that way her grandmother can, you know, uh, use it and things like that. Because, you know, her mother's, her grandmother's, you know, on fixed income and living in, you know, assistant living. So, we're going to let her have the meat and the bread and things like that. And we're going to take, uh, you know, just the other stuff. Uh, we'll let her have the potatoes and all that other stuff. Well, it depends on what we get, but you know what I'm saying. We're going to keep all the snacks and the candy and whatnots and I think they give you dog food and things like that so that'll keep me from having to pay for a lot of this stuff and uh, you know right now I'm the second person in line so I get to pick the good stuff you know I have to fix my windshield because my uh, my hood popped up on my van and while I was on the interstate and cracked my windshield <laughs> yeah stroke of genius stroke of luck huh the hood latch was broke. So, oh well. I'm just lucky that I'm alive. Uh, but anyway, other than that, I'm going to replace the transmission motor mount and one other motor mount. Lily. Just to make sure my engine stays stable because uh, mouth, when I put it in a gear, you know, it, it doesn't jolt hard, but you know, you can tell that it doesn't shift as smooth as it should. So I'm going to change the motor mount, they're only like $21, $15, $20 or something like that and I'll just have my uh, special mechanic to change it for me, you know, give him $50, $60, $75 or something like that to change, you know, my motor mount uh, while I'm getting the tie rod ends put on and, you know, I still need to hustle about 500 bucks before winter comes along so I can get my van in tip-top shape I mean you know I want it to be in tip-top shape you know like it's brand new it's a it's a 03 so you know it's 17 years old it has no rust the engine is wonderful in it and you know uh, the suspension is a lot better and you know uh, of course you know we've been working on it and working on it and changing everything and fixing everything and modifying everything so that's uh that's my goal is to make this almost you know like a brand new van and you know what it's uh it's getting there it's getting there so um just need to keep working keep hustling at it and we'll get it done until the next time folks we love you lisa hip god bless you so, it's a gray, cloudy, rainy, wet day, and, you know, it's not all that warm. You know, the temperature on this side of the country compared to Kentucky is different. And, like I said, we're trying to get prepared for the worst to come because I know that it's not going to be that easy of a winter even if I even if you have a brand new vehicle it's not going to be that easy you know being a van lifer like they say but we'll see so if anybody has a, a, a thousand watt inverter or better that they want that they would like to send or donate then just message us and uh, we will tell you where to send it to <laughs> Anyway, guys, we really appreciate oh, you guys. You on <laughs> yeah, Shelly says, or a pull behind camper. But, mm -hmm. you know, uh, we have to uh, get some other things maintenance before we're ready to do that. But we'll take it. Anyway, guys, it's been real. It's always a blessing to be on here to talk to you guys. Shelly, say hello to them. Hey, guys. Guys, have a wonderful morning. Bully, say hello. Bully. We did. Bully, bully, bully. He's mad at me right now. No, he's looking at the window. Oh. Yeah, he was mad at me because I wouldn't let him jump out at the people. 
Pat. <laughs> we do believe. So, anyway, as y'all can see, that you know, it's kind of crowded back there, but anyway, it's not that bad. It's a nice little camper. A lot of people use these Astros for campers. And this one's all-wheel drive, so it's uh, it's kind of a special. You know, they say they only made like 4,000 of these out of 4 million sold. So this is, you know, a masterpiece. But you got to get those uh, rear, dif you got to get those differentials maintenance. You got to get the transfer case maintenance. It's got transfer case fluid and all that other type of thing that you have to get maintenance. Uh, you need the uh, transmission cooler if you're going to be towing. You know, you can, it, it can handle 5,000 pounds you know towing 5500 they say but that's including what's in the van that's in, in the camper yeah that's including what's in the van and in the camper now you can get some leaf spring ha uh, uh, leaf spring helpers to help you out it may give you another inch or so of ground clearance and you can also get the uh, the airbags but you know I think I want the leaf springs because you can go off-road with those too. And uh, the, the vehicle's on now, you can't even hear it running, can you? And that's the way I like for it to be. That's the way I like for it to be. But it'll get on down the road, let me tell you. <laughs> it's got the traction control. And it's got the ABS. It's got the uh, all-wheel drive. You know, it, it rides good in the rain, and since I fixed that ABS sensor, I had to uh, make an emergency stop twice already, and it stopped on the dime, didn't it, Shelly? Mm -hmm. On the dime, let scared me tell you. Yeah. You scared the crap out of Shelly, and I took it off road the other day, as I told you guys. So, anyway, I'm gonna try to keep it moving, keep it pushing. Gotta do some hustling, guys. And hopefully, y'all are going to be seeing us traveling and journeying and doing all that other crap. But, you know, I need to get this vehicle up to par. <clears throat> Shelly says that, you know, uh, uh, I, <laughs> that there's something always going to be wrong with it because I always want to fix something. But, you know, I'm a guy. I'm a man. So, you know, of course I want to modify my ride. Of course I want it to be beefy and, you know, tough and you know, maintenance and all that other kind. So anyway, God bless you guys. We love you and I'm off here.